Hi everyone, this is Nathan. And this is Heather. And with we're Gamma back. Penguin. Yes, we are Gamma Penguin. <laughs> <laughs> and we're back with another pop for our week of pop openings. And this is another Disney themed one, even though this one is true Disney. The last one was uh, video games, but yeah. this one is true Disney. And I had to get this one. This is a uh, one of my favorite Disney afternoon shows from when I was a kid. It is none other than. Dark Wing Duck. Let's get dangerous. <laughs> Will you punch Indeed. me if I say I don't know anything at all about Dark Wing Duck? I don't think I've ever uh, watched an episode. I'm sorry, everyone. Fun fact. Dark Wing Duck was actually originally supposed to be a spinoff of Duck... Well, it was kind of a spinoff of DuckTales, but like a more direct... And I, I believe have seen some DuckTales, but I just don't know anything about Dark Wing Duck. I think even early concepts had... Um, the crime fighter was actually Uncle Scrooge in the early concepts. I think. I, I, I'll have to double check that, but I do think. I know it was one of the characters, I know, and I know it didn't make sense. But anyway, cool so looking, this does look awesome. It is Darkwing Duck. And he da, is da, number da. 296. Yes, number 296. Let's get a look at that box. So basically, you can get Darkwing Duck. The other series is, of course, him. Launchpad McQuack, which I'd love to get Launchpad. Now, isn't he from DuckTales, though? Yes, that, and that, he's that in was his spin-off. Well, after, after uh, DuckTales ended its run, oh, he, he became his sidekick. I did not know that. And I'm pretty sure, uh, you, you know, it's been so long, uh, he may not have joined to the second season. Yeah, but he is in the show. And Gosselin Mallard was his adopted, uh, I believe was his, kind of his uh, adopted daughter. Cool. That is nice artwork. I love the background. Yes. That's very cool. And on the channel, um, you'll see I have a video for where I reviewed the entire re-release of a Disney afternoon. And this actually was one of my favorite games. So let's go ahead and open this. And uh, recently I was at a friend's house who has a very nice uh, retro arcade in his basement. And this was the game he was playing. It's so much fun to watch. How cute. Look at that. He is so vibrant. I love all the like oh, definitely. The purple and like the kind of... The shape of the fuchsia under of his uh, hat bill, little cloak there. That's awesome. He's cute. That is so cool. Neat. He's definitely. It's it's kind of sad that they. Oh, he has like a turtleneck on. Yes, or an ascot. Oh, <laughs> now there you can see the sleeves. <laughs> yeah, up. at least it's not a dicky. <laughs> yeah. It actually has sleeves. Um, you know, this is one of the characters that I think has remi remained in people's minds, but they just kind of stopped using. Yeah, it's kind of like after I think about ninety six, ninety seven, when the Disney Afternoon kind of went down to a Disney an TV animation here and there. I think it was right around the time that uh, they bought ABC. They just didn't see the purpose in releasing. Uh, Oh, and releasing syndicated television anymore, so. He's cool. I love how colorful he is. It it makes Definitely. him look very, like, very animated. He's sweet. Definitely. So, let's go and put the box back. Awesome. So, this is Darkwing Duck, number 296 in the Pop Disney Collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It speaks for itself. I just uh, can't tell you how awesome this one is. And I'm very glad. I hope I get, um, I'm hoping I get Scrooge McDuck. That would be really cool too. Yep. So without further ado, let's get dangerous. <laughs> and uh, for Gamma Penguin, I'm Nathan. And this is Heather. I hope you'll check out the rest of our pop videos. Have a dangerous day. Have a quacktastic day. Quacktastic. Bye. Bye. Thank you.